Hello, oh, welcome back to Spirit Fair. Hello. Checking to see if I got that right. <laughs> I don't know why my brain is is like that. You know, it's just pro. It's just programmed wrong. <laughs> we. In that one, in that one area, are we here already? Yeah, we weren't that far. Also, we got mail. Eatorama flyer. Oh, we have mail that we haven't actually read. Dear future customer, this is Madison of Eatorama. We are currently running a promotion for our new food delivery service. Stop by Hummingbird to hear all about it. Sales rep is waiting for you. Promotion. This is from Albert, who we're going to see. Uh, what? Stella, make sure to change your address permanently. Have uh, more letters coming shortly. We'll make keep up with your writing. Pen pals are the best pals. Everyone knows that. And how do they? How do I have an address on a boat? <laughs> I don't know. It's magic. Magic. When you, Albert. Can't, when you can't explain something, it's magic, Joe. That's, yeah. No, I, I have fully embraced that. Like religion. I wanted to just hit yes on this. Uh, let's see here. Do we need anything? Can we, can we buy anything else yet? No. Okay. No, we need a whole bunch of crap for the icebreaker. In fact, I think we can look at that, though. We need, like, iron or something. You're looking at the captain's log. Yeah, icebreaker. Oh, okay, cool. We need iron ingots. We need the smelter, right? Is yeah, that oh yeah, the, the, the forge. The forge, that's what we're doing. Oh, it was that, and it was uh, Summer's house. Okay, so should I build the forge first or Summer's house first? Summer? Foundry. Because the foundry we, is friggin' giant. We seem to be doing all right with... Uh, I mean, what's her name? Hasn't the snake lady hasn't complained about it, has she? No, she has. In fact, when I looked at her, it said I. Uh, she said I am very unhappy. Oh really? Yeah. Well, well screw her. <laughs> Get the foundry. Crap. She can be unhappy okay. for a while, right? Yeah. What's, what, what's she gonna do? Leave. Uh. Com Playing a lot and make my life very difficult. Okay, let's just see if I can build her house. I can build her house at the same time. Okay. Are you sure? Okay. Yeah, so here's what I'm immediately going to do, though, is I'm going to edit Ow. this because it's bothering me. That fits so perfectly. Okay, you can go, like... Wait, I can connect the two? Kind of. No, it just wants me to replace them. Okay, that's fine. And then this can go here. Is uh is religion magic, Joe? I mean, do they is that the same thing? Uh I I, I don't know. Miracles, right? I think they, have, miracles. they have miracles. I think miracles are magic. Um I'm not sure if I would call religion magic i think it's more of like a, a a big social club where everyone believes the same thing we gotta go we gotta go to albert to make it right make what the ice breaker thing we don't have steel we, we need to we need to actually use the foundry did we get we need steel we need iron the yeah, iron yeah Ah, uh, here we go. Oh crap, we need a spirit. Okay, so we need a spirit flower and I don't know how to get that. Yeah, also, apparently we need coal. Uh, okay, yeah, we have coal. And I don't know if we need to, like, pay attention to this, because it just kind of looks like we need to do something here, like this. Oh yeah. This is another mini game.
I can Maybe do the heat other up the iron and tell it. I can do the other side, right? Yeah. You need to be in here, though. Oh, okay. I was like, why can't I do that? Keep it between the always, two markers. <laughs> I always forget there are doors. Too hot. Too hot? Oh. Well, I didn't know it was. It got too hot. I was watching a show called Good Omens. Yeah. And the um, the characters in that are one's an angel, one's a demon. And they basically they make uh, stuff happen. Um, like yeah, they call them miracles, but to me it's it's magic, right? I mean, yeah, I, I think miracles are magic, like I said. I think religion is more of just, like, a big social club. We just need to keep it between those two little points until it fills up that heating cage. Oh, I see. Okay. So religion is more about, more about just getting together and um, having a community? I think so, personally. I don't think people would agree with that, though. That are actually into religion. I know really? this. Is, I know that this is like a touchy subject. Talking about we religion, religion, no, relig no religion, no politics. Those are the rules. Crap, radical, Gary. I. Um, I know we can make coal. We just need to throw wood in here. Yeah, that's right. I was just going to say, I think there's a way... Let's people, go to sleep while this is doing that, though. People that are religious are sometimes really religious. Uh, yeah. I... I, 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 I mean... Uh, okay, so here's the thing, right? Is that, like... I, I know religious people that would agree with me. My, my neighbor, my, or my old neighbor in Flagstaff... Uh, John Scott was just like, you know, you can be spiritual and you can be religious. And he said that the main difference between the two was whether or not you basically socialized in a church. Like, do you believe in a god or gods or whatever? Or do you go to church and socialize? That was, in his mind, the big difference. And I, I, I kind of agree with that. We have mail. Also, we can talk to her. Oh, how wonderful. That's not the voice, Joe. No, I realize that now. Incredible, <laughs> Stella. Wood. Plants. There's even an all-natural room for meditation. You really outdid yourself. How well I'll sleep in that hanging bed. Yes, I'll be back to full health in no time at all. And maybe. Listen, I have a favor to ask you. Feed me. <laughs> it, it's become obvious to me that I need to take better care of myself. Uh, you're already a vegetarian. Let, that, let the body listen to the mind. Let the body hit the floor. That's what I was thinking. To that end, I need clarity. I need power and energy. Okay, God, Goku, calm down. Power up. What is what is it like? My power is over five thousand or something like that. I don't know. Uh, it's oh, I know it's over nine thousand. Over nine. That, that was yeah. His power level. That was that's what it was. Positive minerals are what I'm missing right now. Oh my God! You must bring you rocks. What are you, a Wiccan? How dare eat, you? Eat rocks. Tones it, and crystals are connected to the world on an elementary level. Yeah, this is this is what the Wiccans believe. Talking about religion, just as the I moon need... is dark when hidden from the sun, living beings wither when their telluric link is severed. Yeah, talking about religion. This sounds real culty. You got like a cult sort of look on uh, the robe and stuff. Oh my god. You surprised me. <laughs> so Stella, what do you say? 
Could you bring me some gems and minerals to fill up my cabinet? I thought he was going to kill me. Three of them should be enough. And it won't be for nothing, you'll see. I can teach you all about all the interesting properties of each one if you bring them to me. I, uh, you want, you want to talk about religions that sound like magic. Wiccans literally believe in magic. Raccoon Ink Flyer, Protest Flyer. How do I look at things? Okay. Wait, I should, I should have a destination, but I don't know what it is. We need to go get pork chops. That's all the way over here, not in the mines. But we also need, um, we need a spirit, and it doesn't say, like, there's a spirit here, does there? There's question we, marks. We don't have any more room for, well, I mean, we might have a little bit more room. We yeah, need... we could go to the, no, that's the quarry, we've been there. It says question mark. Yeah, we've been there. We need to find out where, where Gwen is. That's, that, what, that's what I was going to say, is like, where the hell is Gwen? There was like a place where she went, right? Where she was from. Can we, should we check the uh, the gate? We already did that last time. Yeah, but she wasn't... She didn't leave the, uh, the ship yet. You think she's at the gate? The upper door, maybe... I can't think of anywhere else she would go unless you can find that mansion that we, we were at once. That's what I mean, is that she's probably there, right? I mean, should maybe. We, the other door might be worth checking. Should we check, like, who, where did Gwen go? <laughs> or something like that. I can't talk to people, so that's going to be all up to you. Oh, not talking to people. I meant, like, look oh, it up. Oh, crap. I took out the wood too early. I didn't even know I could do that. Yeah, I did it. I did it to you. I was thinking. Here we go, Joe. Something for you to say. When the dragon found me back home, I knew I had to leave. I felt I wouldn't heal unless I left. I didn't know it, but I needed love. And no one loves, uh, and, and no love was to be found in the, this accursed place. No one loves me. But in my exile, I met your aunt. I had never seen anyone as joyful as Rose. Filled to the brim with uncontainable life. You remind me a lot of her, Stella. That's ready to pounce. Yep. It's like I'm gonna eat snake. She nursed me back to health little by little. Without her, well, the dragon would have taken me. Right there, I'm sure of it. And I never would have met you. Well, you would have died eventually and met us anyways. She taught me not as one normally teaches, but by opening my eyes to what was already within to the rich interior life unquashed by the dragon. I oh, know it's raining. Unquashed by my father. Yeah, we're gonna have to tell the the frog no. That means twice. we're gonna stop in the middle of a conversation. Yep. To the interconnectedness of all things. Oh my God! Shut up. <laughs> I'm sorry. I am sick of her and her damn hippie culty lifestyle. <laughs> the flowers. Yeah. <laughs> to the universal love. This is this immense debt I owe her. Well, maybe that's why I feel the need to teach you. Yeah, good. Shut up. Did I give her food already? I fed her. Oh, did you? Okay. Yeah. Sneer frog. Watered all the plants. Shut the hell up. No, I think the rain is doing that for us. Oh, I pushed yes. Whoops. It's hard not to sometimes. Can it's I fine. Talk, can I talk to him and end it? Oh, he won't end it. Well, 
uh, this is this is a fantastic time to talk to you, Gary, about our uh, my next topic. Oh, okay. what? I said sponsor. <laughs> no, <laughs> I wish. Yeah, you know, Gary, maybe we could get sponsored by the thing I'm about to tell you about. So, have you heard of the wonderful? Uh, I, I know you don't drink coffee, so you would not drink this anyways, but there is a coffee where they let the coffee beans be eaten and digested uh, by a particular Egyptian cat. Cat? Uh -huh. Yes. So the, the particular style of coffee is they let the coffee beans be eaten and digested, and then obviously, uh, you know, yeah. excreted. You can say poop. Okay. Pooped you can say, out. You can say poop on this channel. <laughs> That's all big not to grow a city one out, but yeah, it, it, it pooped out and you then can... uh and then picked out from that and mm -hmm. then ground and then brew. Nice. Would you drink uh, that? So I've actually seen people drink it. On YouTube, it was like a, it wasn't like a big thing or anything because I, I don't think coffee is like as popular as like it, literally anything else. Nice. But uh, it, it, it people were saying that it tasted like really really good diner coffee. Oh, I thought you were gonna say diarrhea. <laughs> no, I they were just like no, it's it's still coffee, but it's like really not bitter. It's unbitter coffee. Mm. And they and they were trying it black. Which is um, the the complaints that I always hear, especially from Sean's mom, because she hates coffee because it's too, she doesn't like the uh, bitter tannins that coffee has. Um, and my answer is I would try it, but I wouldn't try it for hundreds of dollars. Like it's you know, no, uh, here's here's something that was crapped out of a cat. A hundred dollars. Uh, yeah, let's see here. Uh, I can live without it. Yeah, oh, okay. I, I was wrong. It's not $100. So it's, and it's also, the cat is a civet. I was wrong about that. Oh, huh. I thought I was going to do it. Okay, no, it does sell for hundreds of dollars. A, a cup of it is worth $80, though. I can't go there, Joe. Okay. Is that a, a course? Cup. A cup of civet poop coffee is eighty dollars. Still, I'm not eating. I mean, I'm not paying to eat excrement. Where is where is Gwen? Um, is that it? Is that the place that mm, the villa? Is that where her um place is? Joe. Can you, can, you do, can you do a search? <laughs> yeah, all right. And also exit the screen. Yeah, hold on. There. Spirit bearer. Where did Gwen? Yeah, where did and I and it says Gwen go. Your next task is to task is to track down where Gwen went. Ask the other spirits on your ship where she might have gone. Turns out she's gone back to her family's old estate again. So you need to head back to Villa M-A-G-G-I-O-R-E to find her. Villa M -A what? M-A-G-G-I-O-R-E. This. She's here. Oh, that's the place I was talking about. Yeah. I'm just going to try and skip over the rain thing. So we're gonna go out into the middle of nowhere, and then we're gonna go there. Okay. So I don't feel like dealing with the. But w while we're on our way, we should ask the spirits where she is because that's technically part of the quest. I talked to them though. Okay. Did he say this before? Yeah, we've. I've said it a million times. See, yeah, that's the only thing he'll talk about. I want my pork chops. And you know what happened when I talked to. I don't remember Snake Lady's name. Summer. Summer. She even has a hippie name. Yeah, it is a rather hippie name. 
I don't actually have anything against uh, hippies or Wiccans. I want to let that be known before someone clicks away from the video and be like, this guy's hateful. No, I just like making fun of them. Just like most people like making fun of, uh, I don't know, white people. Um, whoa, okay, she's in there. I was going to say she just disappeared. No, she's not in there. Or the, uh, it's, it's okay. the Velma show. How do we get in? Oh, okay, there. Try talking to her. I'll try talking to her. And then I think that's the end. Oh, Peter. I gave her coffee last time. Um, she says that she... No? Coffee. Oh, you know what? I, w I tried to give her coffee last time. Said that she could she... still taste something. Anyways, I'm going to end there. Um... Uh, we'll find Gwen in the next one. Yeah. Bye, Bye. everybody.